Eyes peeled, attentive ears, quick yeah. reflexes. Oh. This is how almost three billion people around the world choose to spend their time. It's not the most relaxing of pastimes, that's for sure. Matthew Pickering realised early on that consoles are much more than just fun and games. He's the CEO of Power League Gaming, an esports and gaming company based in Dubai. So the big idea with PLG is that we'll produce the region's biggest esports tournaments and find new disruptive ways to produce content to reach gaming audiences for our clients. Working with big international brands like FIFA, KFC and Intel, PLG produces different events and videos to engage the gaming community. Their content varies from competitive events to talk shows reviewing the latest releases or podcasts where gamers can share their tips. Last year they opened a creative studio, the first of its kind in the region. We invite five guys and girls down to the show to try and amplify their gaming careers, so give them the tools and give them the ability to be able to become self sort of proficient in streaming and content creation in the gaming space. So super, super excited. As the world gaming industry grows nearly 9% yearly, the Middle East is leading the pack with annual growth of 13%. For the Middle East and Africa, there's still quite a bit of room um, in terms of bringing new gamers into the market, in terms of um, really localizing games uh, specifically for a more Arabic audience. PLG is tapping into an audience of 230 million players in the MENA region, focusing on local gaming trends and speaking their language literally. Something that's quite different or defining for PLG is that we are Arabic first, so we um, actively build strategies to connect with Arabic gaming audiences. It's a sign that companies are looking at different communities. Gaming's importance in society is really becoming more than, than just an entertainment platform. And brands and uh, other industries, game developers and publishers, they can all leverage this trend in order to uh, continue to grow. So for Matt and his team... Luckily, we've got a company full of very good Call of Duty players. <laughs> It's game on rather than game over.